Hey guys, how are you? Okay. I decided to make some screens up because we had a lot of screens on another property uh, that were destroyed. And the funny thing is I didn't have any of the screens. And then I found a couple when I raked up the leaves. But anyway, these are the screens I started making up. And when you have a frame, that's easy to measure. You know, if you don't, you got to measure inside the track. But these are some of the ones I was replacing. And I needed three like this. Now, as you can see, I already cut up some. And I'm just going to quickly show you how to measure, you know, to get this thing going the way you'd want to do it. Let me see if I could put this camera somewhere in a way where you can, I mean, the phone where you can see what I'm doing. All right. So what we're going to do now, listen, I don't make screens. It's not what I do. I don't make screens. You got these little corners. You buy them at Home Depot, Lowe's, wherever. And you buy this metal tracking. Now, if you have the frame, that makes it easy. You put one there. Measure it up. Remember, measure from the inside of this corner. That's where it's going to slide in, right? So that's going to be your end. So when you take your measurements, you put it on the end right there. I'm going to hold it in place. I'm going to mark the end of the piece here. Mark the end. And then I'm going to put this on my mark. And I'm going to, again, move it back to mark the inside. Now, that should come up to about the same size I made these. Let's just double check because I don't want to mess it up because I'm trying to make a video. Perfect. It's perfect. Now, I see the mark. I'm going to put a little line so I know what side I want. I'm going to give it a quick cut. Okay. As you can tell by the stuff I have laid out here, this is not what I do for a living for sure. But I, I like to... With that being said, now, here's how the framing works. I got the bottom and the top and two sides. So bottom, you always make sure the beading stays in line. Like that would be backwards, right? So you put the beading in. And there's a kind of a little slot. You make sure it slides in there. If you don't get it in that slot, you'll be hammering this thing to death trying to get it in. And you put another one here. Get that first slot, push it in. As you can see, this is not that difficult. Now we go with a longer one. Remember, bead in. And I am not, like I said, I'm not a, a screen guy. Um, in fact, this is the first day I've ever tried it. Never tried it before. And it worked out really well. So I needed three of these the same size. Now we're at the last one. Put one in here. Slid right in, put this track in here. Slid right in, I need one more corner for here. And I had to go get the corner. And as you can see, well, this one might be a little tougher. It slides right in. Okay. There's how it came out. Okay, I needed to replace this one because I needed three like this. I only found one. And as you can see, it's going to be fine. Okay, I'm going to replace the screen on this one. I'm going to leave the frame. But see how good that came out? Now, let me pile these up. So I got my three. And uh, I'll show you the frames that I made. I made these three frames... In a matter of 10 minutes, slap three of them together in a matter of minutes. So now I'm getting myself together. I just got to put one more together. I already cut the two bottoms, the two sides. So I'm just going to snap them together and we're done. But it's easy to do, people. Don't be scared of it. You buy the uh, these corner pieces. Okay, they're like two bucks. Okay, each frame is going to need one. You need four corners, right? And then you buy, I'm going to call it the beading, uh, the spline it's called. You buy this little spline stuff. I got, a, you know, the spline. And I got 100 feet of screen back there in the corner, right there. I'm going to zip that all together. I don't need to bore you with the last part. Maybe I'll make another video on the screening. But do me a favor, like, subscribe. You never know what you're going to get. 
Sometimes you get trains in my videos. Sometimes you get sound systems in the videos. Sometimes you get quads and dirt bikes. You never know. Like, subscribe. Thanks.